Apple just gave your customers a spam folder. Here's how to keep your communications out of it. iOS 26 is here and it's shaking up how calls and texts get through to your customers. The big news? Screen unknown senders. When it's turned on, messages from numbers not in your contacts get sorted into folders. Messages, unknown senders, spam, recently deleted and unread. That means your text might take longer to get read or worse, end up in spam. Time-sensitive alerts like OTP codes will still break through for one hour. On the call side, iOS 26 is cutting down on spam with screen unknown callers. Phones will ask inbound callers to state their name and reason before alerting the user. The information shows up as a transcript so the user can decide whether to answer. If the caller doesn't share the details, the phone stays silent for 30 seconds before it rings. I'm all for getting fewer calls about my car's extended warranty, but if iOS 26 treats your business like a robocaller, that's a problem. Here's the catch. Messages may take longer to reach customers. Even compliant texts can get misfiled as spam. And call metrics may start looking fuzzy since transcripts blur what answered really means. So what can you do? One, encourage customers to save your number early. Two, use branded channels like RCS and branded calling to stand out. Three, diversify with multi-channel strategies. Don't rely on SMS or voice alone. Messaging just got more complicated, but you don't have to go it alone. Twilio is testing these changes, staying on top of Apple's updates, and helping businesses adapt. Check our blog for the full breakdown.